even though officials have said the area is safe, the community here is very unsettled. Security Over the reopening of this massive sinkhole, tonight. one resident That's said that he feels it could happen to anyone at any time. Now the engineering the firm has been here around the clock working on this, and, and, and they are confident there is no danger to any other hotel or residents on the road. They should be one of the other neighbors was killed in this very same spot two and a half years ago. People who live in this community are shocked at the answer to such a sinkhole. Could have shut the door, you let it fly then. Sorry. What do you want? I'm looking for Aaron James. Is this the right place? Aaron! Company! Oh my god damn it, you act like I can't fucking hear. What the fuck are you wearing? Nothing. Well, listen, I'm going camping with my buddy from the army for a few days. You know the survival man off the TV? Why don't you get your sorry ass up and clean this fucking place up while I'm gone? See this shit I have to put up with. Sorry about all that back there, man. She keeps the place a pit. Dang, man, it's nice to see you. How long's it been? 16, 17 years? That's more like 20, I think. Hold on. Drive. Damn, I was thirsty. Yeah, I seen your survival show on television. Looks like you're doing pretty good for yourself. Survival, man. Yeah, it's been all right. Long time. Anyway, how you doing? How you doing? Oh, I'm not back there fighting with that bitch. I stay out on the Gulf fishing. Anything besides sitting in the tank or listening to her ass complain all day. 
Hey, so all that stuff on your show, you know, you drinking your pee and eating the bugs and worms and stuff, all that real or is yeah. it a stage? It's real. It's always been real, man. You know me better than that. I don't do bullshit. I'm the only one that ever did it for real. I don't drink my own piss. Now, that's a good thing because I've been waiting to kiss you in the mouth ever since I got in a truck. Well, hey, how about you drink one of these fucking beers and let's have ourselves a good time? All right, fine. Make it tough, brother. To the good old days. The old days. What the hell are they? I don't see anything, Command. Eagle 2, I can't see him. Can you get that to there's a fucking army out there! Get the rest of some fucking rats out there, man! Eagle 2! Eagle 3, take cover! I'm sending Don't you get your fucking head down to that fucking rifle! So whatever happened to that girl you was, uh, with, with stationed up at Leonardwood? She left me when I found out she was fucking around. <laughs> Funny how that works, ain't it? Come on, this is a place. 1,500 acres of private property. All ourselves. What about this? It's just a sign, man. It ain't gonna get in our way. I'm about to tell you to stop. I guess it kind of does tell you to stop. Fine, but... fine, fine. Oh, sorry, man. It won't be in your way. So, uh, what about the kid? Uh, we didn't get much time together. You know, she used to spend every summer up at my place, maybe two weeks, and we just kind of drifted apart. Anyway, she's in college now. She's got no time for me. That's a shame, bro. I hate to hear when families break up. That's why I never got married. But that wife of yours had the tightest little ass. She was something else. She has some perky ass titties too, man. You ever still talk to her? Nope. Been divorced almost 18 years now. Damn. I'd be kicking myself in the ass every single day if I lost something like that. Ann was her name, wasn't it? Must be a good place to camp. Protection if it rains, got water, firewood. We camp here. All right, cool, man. Well, I want to see you starting a fire like you do on the Survival Man show. Rubbing two sticks together, you know? And hell, after that, if we got time, won't you jump in that lake over there and catch us an alligator for dinner? You sit up the tent. I'll get some firewood. Fair enough. Dog! It's all torn up and the poles don't fit anyway. You know, dog just fell into some kind of hole. Man, if I was in there, she wouldn't even got out. You gotta be careful, man. Them things are all over the woods out here. Some of them are super deep. Who names their dog, dog? Instructions. 
Oh, I guess I'll put your fancy ass bullshit tent together. It requires instructions and poles while you walk around the woods being survival, man, looking at butterflies and squirrels fucking on the trees. You know what? Fuck, dude. My dog falls in a hole and you've been up my throat all fucking day. What the hell's going on? Listen, man, you're right. We should be out here celebrating, talking about the old days, not listening to my bullshit. So how about this? You go put your dysfunctional tent together with instructions and got us a lighter right here. I'll start us a fire and we'll partake in some recreational substances. Oh shit, dude. We're not going to smoke that whole thing here, are we? Look at that right, we are. What else will we do with it? Let's get this shit rolling, huh? To the old days. To the old days. Don't lip it like that, bitch. Come on, now. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> You gotta go outside, girl? Yeah. Okay. Let's put you out. Come on. Let's go see what goofball's doing. All right, sweetheart. There you go. Oh, you're getting old. Go on. Go pee. Oh. What the hell are you doing? How do you think I'm doing? I'm trying to catch you some breakfast. How do you make this look so easy anyways? Hey, what'd you catch? What the fuck are you laughing at, asshole? It's a harmless water snake, idiot. They don't even bite. Oh yeah? Well, just so you know, that was a fucking cottonmouth, and it almost bit me in the fucking face. Your ass wouldn't be so smart if that thing almost tried to bite you. Do you know what? Fuck you. Fuck that goddamn snake. I'm out of this shit, motherfucker. We should set up camp before it gets dark there, don't you think? Nope. Let's keep up with Dog. She's headed to the bluffs, and there's going to be good shelter there in case it rains. All right, survival dude. You can go on up there and set your broke dick tin up and I'll follow up after I fill a cat hole. Roger that. Gunner's dumping. Ain't been called that in years. down there? Danny, you all right? Are you hurt? I'll be all right. I just go get help. Hold on real quick, bro. I gotta get this on video. Would you stop fucking around? All right? I'll be fine. Now go get help. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Dogs here we have the survival man. And he's stuck down in a pit in the forest. Then hurry up, Gunner! Because he don't fucking listen to nobody when they're telling him there's pits in the forest and he needs to be careful. Stop fucking around, Aaron. Those edges are weak. Well, now your smart ass is stuck down in there, and I'm gonna have to fucking save you. Just stop it. Go get help. I'm warning you, Aaron. Anyways, I guess there's more to survival than just staying alive. Ain't that right, survival man? You Shit, you idiot! Ass. It's giving away stuff. Just stop. Just stop. Yeah, yeah. Quit your bitching. Jesus. Gunner's Aaron, got you back. <laughs>
Aaron. Fucking antler sticking out his side. Oh, God. Come here. All right, man. Come here. Come here. Here we go. Here we go. Don't touch my arm. You're going to have to quit being a pussy. We got to pull that out. Uh, uh, uh. Stop, stop, just fucking stay. Oh, God. Just stay away. Just stay away. We got to pull this bitch out. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Oh, God damn it. You're going to have to suck this just, up. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Okay. What are you waiting for? Fucking God bitch. damn it. Hey. On the count of three. Fuck. One. Two. Oh, God. Don't touch me! Don't touch gotta me! Gotta stop the fucking bleeding. Do we got anything we can uh, suture or stitch this shit up with? Uh, 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 Maybe we can tighten uh, this pack up. Shut up! Just shut up! Uh, uh, uh. And the dog looks pretty fucked up too. All right, dude. Do we got any kind of sutures or needle or anything, man? Yeah, we got shit. We got stuff. Aaron, calm down there. All right, now listen. We gotta keep our heads if we're gonna survive this thing. What the hell was that? Those are copperhead snakes. I've seen three. We gotta be careful. Careful? We need to kill these motherfuckers. Hey, hey, hey. Don't kill them. Might need to eat them. Well, listen. I ain't fucking planning on staying down here too long. Especially with all these fucking snakes. You know I hate snakes. And I damn sure I ain't eating no snake. Calm down. Hey, uh, take an inventory. I want to know what survival supplies we have for later. We'll find a way out of here, even if we have to use these tunnels. I bet you they lead up. No! We need to climb out of this motherfucker. We need a fucking rope and a hook or something. Gunner? I said calm down. We got to keep our heads if we're going to survive this. You're right. You just need to keep cool, man. Somebody's bound to come along here sooner or later. What well, if they don't? Find a way out. Well, oh, let's see here. We got some cooking utensils, a knife, about five instant meals. A Survival Man TV show kit! $24.95! Let's see what's in this motherfucker, shall we? Oh, look at that! A rape whistle! I'm Survival Man! I'm getting raped! Thermal blanket. One thermal fucking blanket. Uh, fire starter. A little bullshit knife. Uh, I'm guessing that's a fucking credit card. Platinum edition since you're a rich TV show prick. And a fucked up ass compass. You know what we don't have? Some fucking rope so we can climb out, smart ass. So I guess you need to put in the fine print, it doesn't help you if you fall in a fucking cave, now does it? Gunner, calm down. This is all your fucking fault. You did this. You fucking ass. You better hope we get out of here. Because if we don't, 
You're gonna be dead. These fucking hands right here. You're pretty much a survival televangelist, ain't you? Because you can't get nobody out of shit! Oh yeah, that's right. I'm getting the fuck out of here. I don't know about you! Get the fuck out of here! Get ah! Ah! God damn it! Something. This is all your fucking fault. If you just fucking listened to me the first time when I told you these things were all over the damn woods, we wouldn't be in this fucking spot. But now I'm gonna fucking die in here. Hey, I don't wanna fucking die in here. Gunner. You're scaring my dog, boy. Fuck you. And that goddamn dog. Gunner. Let's go easy, boy. What the hell is Jonesy? We got separated. You left for out there? Fuck wrong with gun. Fuck you, driver. The fuck we gonna do now? She's in a good place. Let's just call in a fucking airstrike on their asses. Eagle 3, this is Eagle 1. Give me a map, Charlie. Eagle one, I'm on my last man. Get your fucking asses up. Man, go. I'm gonna go get him. Okay. I'm sorry. Listen, you know tanks and apparently large holes in the ground make me go nuts. Let alone snakes. Yeah, I know. We ain't climbing out of this thing now. It's gonna get dark soon. There you go. I think we should get a fire going, get some smoke out that hole, somebody see us. You think somebody's looking for us? Nobody's looking for me. What about that girlfriend of yours? How long before she calls the authorities? Oh yeah, probably never. I'm pretty sure she packed her shit and left just as soon as we pulled out of the driveway. Man, you don't ever change, do you? Daddy said I always knew how to pick them. Good old days. Yeah, good old days. What the hell are you doing? I'm organizing. What do you think I'm doing? Count up all the firewood, put it in separate piles. I figure about a hundred fires. hundred fires? You mean a hundred days? I tell you what, I ain't sitting in this sinkhole with you and these damn snakes for a hundred days. You must have lost your mind. Technically, it's a cenote. Sinkholes are convex. There's a sinkhole we could have climbed out. Now this is a cenote. Cenote is a concave. Just like this. Carved out of sandstone. Just be thankful we're not sitting in three feet of water. Hey, just do the math with me. We got plenty of water. We got snakes and critters that we can catch and eat. Lots of firewood. Signal fires, cook up food. The temperature in here is constant. I bet you it's about 68 degrees. So we ain't gonna freeze. And these tunnels, we can explore them, find a way out. Look. All you gotta do is stay cool, okay? Someone doesn't come and find us, we'll find a way out. It'll be that as it may. I ain't eating no fucking snake. Dog. 
So, so what? We, we got to split our rations with that dog now, too? Aaron, two seconds ago you didn't want to eat any snake. Now you're worried about dog eating some? We keep her healthy, all right? She can hear things up above that we can't hear. She can use those tunnels way better than we can and find us a way out. No. We keep dog healthy. So help get us out of here. Well, I ain't eating snake. And as long as it's only snake, I guess I'll let that pass. Hey, look that away. Those are emergency rations. We don't touch them. I just told you I wasn't eating no damn snake. Especially when I got like three bags of macaroni and cheese in there. Hit the racks, Private. Torch is getting ready to die. <clears throat> Scratch it against the wall and then fan it. It'll wake it up. Oh, good call, survival man. What the hell are we gonna do when your torch goes out? Crawl back in the pitch black following that string? Who in the hell goes camping without a flashlight anyway? Shut up. Let's turn back. I'm turning back. Can you turn around? Yeah, I'm gonna try. Rope's still attached to my wrist, so just follow me. Alright. Ah. Hey, stop using that lighter, man. That's all we got. Conserve it. If you think I'm crawling through the dark with all these snakes all over the place, you've lost your damn mind. I'm serious, Aaron. Stop using the lighter. I'm serious, too. I brought the damn thing. If you want to start a fire, you can rub two sticks together. Get your ass going, mud. Go. Go. Dog! Whoa! What the hell did you do? I think she's slowing up progress. Just lit a fire under her ass, that's all. Stupid idiot. You know, for someone who's afraid of snakes, you should treat the one thing that's keeping the snakes away like shit. Dog! Come here! Come here, dog! She ain't coming to someone who treats you like shit. If you get bit, it's your own fault. Well, hey, man, that torch is going out. Let me squeeze past you. I got the lighter. I'll lead the way. Do it. Follow the string. <sighs> Get on my foot! Uh, sorry. Uh, Motherfucker, slow down, all right? Where's the lighter? I don't know. It's something about the fucking snake. I dropped it. Jeez. Christ, Aaron, it's gone by now. So just stop panicking, all right? We got to get up there. We got to find this lighter. Now, what kind of snake was it? It was a fucking copperhead, dude. I know a fucking copperhead when I get bit by one. Just slow down, all right? We got to go up and get the lighter. No, no. Then you're going to get fucking bit, too, and we're both going to die. Oh, we ain't going to die from a copperhead bite. You know that. Bullshit. People die from copperhead bites all the time. All right. All right. Stay here. I'll get the lighter. All right. Damn you. Ah! 
I don't see no goddamn lighter, you idiot. I can't find it. <laughs> dog! Dog, come on! Come on. Dog's here. Good girl. Good girl. Okay, look. Calm down, man. You hear me? Hey, you hear me? Grab the string. Follow the string all the way back. And you drag that foot. You don't use it. You don't push on it, all right? Get out of here. Hey, hey, didn't you suck the poison out and tie a tourniquet on it or something? You're a fucking idiot, Aaron. All right? Stop watching John Wayne movies. It's an old wives' tale. Because I ain't sucking anything out of you. Nothing, man. Oh, it's something. Otherwise, you wouldn't be staring at me like that. What am I staring? Yeah, hell, you was staring. What, you think it's funny I'm eating snake all of a sudden? I didn't say that. Oh, you didn't say shit. But I can hear you fucking thinking that shit all the way over here. Good girl. 
Man, you're too sensitive. Sensitive? Yeah. I ain't fucking sensitive. I'm just observant, that's all. You can observe all the shit you want. I wasn't staring. Even a fucking dog is staring at me. You know what? Both you motherfuckers better watch what you're thinking around here. You want to know what I was thinking? I was thinking of going out that second tunnel tonight. See how far the string will let me go. Listen, man, you're feeling better. There's no way with all these snakes and that constant breeze that those holes don't go somewhere. Do whatever you want, Commander. Alpha 27, this is Lima 475. We have WIA. We're pinned down and our tank's dead. Request an immediate airstrike. Alpha 27, you read me? Where you going? You don't leave me here alone. Come here. Dog. Come back here, dog. Dog, come back. Dog. No. No, no, no. No, no, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on.
fucking animal! This all your fucking fault! Hey, John. <laughs> That's a good girl. That's a good girl. What the? There's a dog barking at you. Oh, shut up. Dog, shut up. That's a search chopper. Get some smoke, smoke, smoke. Hey! Hey! Down here! Holy shit. Keep those leaves going. Come on, get some smoke up there. Hey! Hey! That is a search copter, for sure. I can tell by the sound. boss! Come on, boys! Down here! Hey! Fuck. Help! No. Help us! Oh. Wait here! Help us! Uh. Survival man on TV. Well, that shit ain't helping us now, now is it? Why don't you fashion a radio out of dog shit? Do something! Get off your fucking ass and help us out! Goddamn, do something! Talk to me if you want. One more fucking time. I'll bust your damn head wide open. You reading me now, Gunner? <laughs> God damn it! All right. I just think you should acknowledge the fact that we're in here because of you! <coughs> Fuck, man. I'm gonna fucking die in here. It's all your fucking fault. How we do last night? Nothing. Fuck, man! I swear it seems like day after day, I get the smallest worm. I get the smallest beetle. I mean, fuck! Look at me, skin and bones, and from what it appears, you've done nothing but gain weight since we fell in this hole. I thought that was the deal. 50-50. I cook and tend to the fire, and you fucking catch food for us so we could survive. Shut up, Gunner. You haven't stopped talking since we fell down in this goddamn pit. My body's trained for this, all right? It's trained to survive. It knows I'm in survival mode. Hell, dog knows I'm in survival mode. You. You know, you live your life in a goddamn fantasy, and you always have. <laughs> Coming from the dude who's a reality TV oh, shut star. Shut up with that bullshit, all right? You know, everything I've ever done is real. As real as this goddamn sand. You. Huh. You don't even have a life. You're a figment of my imagination. You think I saved your sorry ass in Afghanistan? Fuck you. You've been dead ever since. This is all your fault right here. Told you have never gotten killed if you didn't make me crawl from this fucking pit to be gutter. All you have to do is make me fucking loader. Is that so fucking hard? You know I'm claustrophobic! Fucking We'd still have a driver if you didn't make it stay in this motherfucker instead of get up and running on this shit! Half the shit that comes out of your mouth makes no fucking sense. We're here. We're either gonna tighten our shit up, or we're never gonna get out of here. You reading me, Private? Are you gonna fucking pull rank on me now? That just gone off the fucking window, bro! No, goddammit! As long as you're in my tank, you're gonna do what you're doing. God, I've been giving you the biggest bug, the biggest worm, even the biggest snakes when I was catching that. Yeah, when we fell in this fucking hole, there was a ton of snakes in here. You mean to tell me the amazing survival man can't catch a fucking snake anymore? Well, you think it's easy going in that hole every night? You figure I got a grocery store at the end of it? No, but I find it hard to fucking believe that the amazing survival man can't catch us a fucking snake. It's been six weeks. 
Not a goddamn snake left in this hole. You should know that. Figure it out, guy. You know what else I don't get? I haven't crapped in ages. You're still crapping. And you're leaving it in the fucking pit over there? It stinks. Oh, so your shit doesn't stink either, huh? No, but I got the decency to bury him. If I had the fucking energy, I would bury my shit. All the energy's going out of your mouth. You know what? Fuck this shit. We've been feeding an extra mouth for too long, sitting here starving. The hell are you saying? You know damn well what I'm saying. It's about time we had a fucking decent meal in here. Son of a bitch, I'll call you ah! Wolf! Fuck this man. I gotta get some real food. What the fuck do you want to do? Want me to fucking call Amazon? Get him to drone drop a pizza down the hole? God damn it, Gunner! You are as dumb as you look. You get that, right? It's been me who's catching all the food. I gotta feed me. I gotta feed Dog. I'm sick of feeding you. I'm hunting for all of us right now. You don't do a goddamn thing. Save your worthless life by chopping half your foot off, and all you do is complain about it now. You know what? Fuck it. You go hunting. I'm done, man. I don't got the energy to go back in that hole. It's easy. All you gotta do is go in there, go as far as you can, you hit halfway, I'll pull on the rope, that's when you stop, just like you've been doing for me. You take Dog. Dog will go in there, she'll go ahead of you, she'll chase the snakes for your sorry ass, she'll pin them up against the wall. All you have to do is move in for the you kill. You know goddamn good and well she's gonna leave me in that fucking She's not gonna fucking leave gig. you. She's better trained than you are, asshole. You know, all this time, she should be fucking in love with you. She's scared to death of you. She hates you. So do I. All right, what the fuck ever. Come on. Oh, it's Christmas time for me, is it? No, shut the fuck up. Thanks for the present, big man. Come on, dog. Come on, dog. Just Let's show go. Him what, show him what a real man can do when he wants to hunt. Fuck. Come on, baby. Dog's worth more than you are, Gunner. Oh, come on. Come on, sweetheart. It's all right. No, she gentle with her. She fucking hates me. Go easy with her. Come on, baby. She'll know what to do as soon as she gets a scent on him. Oh, go ahead, baby. Give me the fucking torch. Take the rope. You get to halfway. I'll tug on I it when you... I fucking got it, man. Give me the goddamn torch. That's why you only made private. And stayed there. Well, this is why your fucking wife left you. Yeah, fuck you. Funny asshole. joke. Keep that fucking fire going. Just shut up and go, Gunner. Uh. Good luck, Gunner. Do with that. Son of a bitch. Come on, dog. Man. Come here. Ugh, come on, you can't keep running from me. Dog! God damn it, dog. Quit on me too, huh? Huh?
That's all right. I'm gonna eat your ass just like I'm gonna eat your daddy. So, <clears throat> oh, don't go out, don't go out, don't go out. No, uh, oh, God damn it. <clears throat> they fall this fucking string back. Come on. Oh, fuck. Are you kidding me? You motherfucker. What's wrong? Why are you so nervous? It's not like you. Come here. Looks like the bastard found his way back. Yeah, I guess you ain't the only fucking hunter in this hole, are you? Hey man, I'm sorry about the rope. The thing broke right in the middle as I was pulling on. You pulled too hard. It's not my fault. I want to run under the bridge. I want to run under the bridge, Commander. What the hell did you do to her? She's shaking like a leaf. Left me, man. She didn't leave you. Shit. Train better than you are. I didn't even want to look at you. You remember all them good times we had when we were stationed out at Leonard Wood? Good times. Go on, lie down. Shit, dude. Who was that? Guy you used to live next to, you and Ann, when y'all was there on base. The dude from the motor pool. I don't know. He had the big, big old girl. You know, with the nasty ass titties. Shit looked like a piece of bologna on a damn pile of mashed potatoes. Yeah, that one night we partied over at their house and you and Ann fell asleep. I know you remember that shit. Her and her old man, we stayed up drinking for about another hour before that lightweight passed out. And shit, it was on point, dude. The second he passed out, she was talking about how boring he was and how she felt she wasn't wanted. Hell, he was studying for OCS all the time. He didn't have no time for her. And she was banging everybody on post. But yeah, the second he went out, dude, she started airing them titties and shaking that big old ass in my face. It wasn't fucking 15 minutes before I had her ass bent over that mantle, banging her out. <clears throat> Shit. She was quiet as a church mouse, too, but the thing that fucked me up, I was for sure that the damn smell would have woke y'all up. I mean, she had some serious hygiene problems going on there. I remember calling her Sunbeam because it was like that yeast was rising. She was baking fucking bread down in there, man. Yeah, he showed up at my dorm a few weeks later talking about I gave his old lady warts. I was like, you better pump brakes, brother. She gave me the fucking warts. That shit, and that's the real reason they got divorced. I figured you knew that because her and Ann were such good friends. But they were both freaks, dude. I mean, y'all had to be the two stupidest motherfuckers on post because y'all didn't even know about it. One night Ann come in the bathroom and old girl was fucking blowing me off. Wasn't about 45 minutes later Ann got curious to see how this dick was cuz. She wanted to know what that taste was like. So I fucking put the south in her mouth. I mean, it's like, do I tell you that she's a fucking freak? Because Ann was the only girl on base that would take it up the ass. And you just can't give up something like that. I mean, you, you gotta see where I'm coming from, right? Did you ever find out who the father of that kid was? I'm pretty fucking sure it ain't you. Yeah, she showed up at my door talking about she is pregnant. And I ain't being responsible for a goddamn thing that comes out of that snatch. I mean, fuck, dude, if she had as many dicks sticking out of her as she had stuck in her, she'd look like a fucking porcupine, you know what I mean? Shit, dude. I would have told you, but yeah, go to sleep, motherfucker. It's a new day in this hole.
Sunshine, how'd you sleep last night? The fuck you do, Gunner? <clears throat> well, to be exact, I got your fucking fingers off. But just two of them. You can still write your name. I just had to do a little bit of payback for cutting my foot off. Because that shit damn sure sucks. You made a mistake, Gunner. You should have killed me when you had the chance. I see, that's where you're wrong. Uh, so, rumor has it in this cave, I don't know if you've heard or not, but uh, me and Dog, I see you, uh, we came to a little agreement last night. We're gonna keep you alive. Uh, and we were sitting there talking, and Dog came up with the idea. He's like, hey, let's keep Danny alive as long as possible, and we'll cut him off piece by piece, and he figured out we'd have a food source for about a month. Oh, motherfucker's pretty good at math. You should have taken my legs, and you're gonna pay for that mistake. But you never knew shit about survival. Hmm, well, unfortunately for you, I'm gonna show you all about survival. Something you didn't show the whole world on your show. But instead of taking your legs, I'm gonna take your nipples, I'm gonna take your ears. I'm gonna even take that little small wanker you got there. You know, Mr. Johnson. I'm sure you ain't forgot about him. It's been a while since he had some attention. But, we got no refrigeration down here. So, we gotta keep you alive, and that's good for you, you know. Only problem I have right now is, I left my knife, the sharp one, down that tunnel right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Gunner. <laughs> You're just a dream, man. It's a fucking altered state of reality. <laughs> You're dead already. Hmm. Well, that may sound good and help you cope with your situation. Well, I'm very much here, sitting on your lap. And I'm not dead. Give it about 30 days, and you sure as shit will be. After I'm done with you, I'm gonna bash your little fucking head in with a rock. Then I'm gonna eat that little bitch too. But if you'll excuse me, I've got to go find that goddamn knife. You know I can't never keep up with shit. So, I'll be back. We'll have, uh, you know what? Since you fucking said that. Hey, dog, what do you think about Leg of Danny tonight? Huh? 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 She likes that idea. So, Buttercup, mwah, you stay fresh, baby, and I'll be right back for you. Peace out. Keep an eye on that one. Be shifty, dog. We gotta get back to the tank! Damn you! We're gonna stay in place, you're gonna check your six to calm the fuck down, brother! Run, fire that weapon! Ugh! <sighs> 
get the tourniquet. Hey, Gunner, I'm still the best damn barbecuer you ever knew. Ain't that the truth? Yeah. Hey, dog, come here. Here you go, sweetheart. Ain't that better than snake? Damn. Don't call me, Commander. I told you about that bullshit. Just wait your turn. Yeah, I take so. Oh, go on. The hell's wrong with you? Come on, it ain't snake! He never knew a damn thing about survival, Gunner. Not a damn thing. You should know better. You don't eat meat. Yeah, you won't even live. You know, I can't believe I went my whole life without ever having tea. Sweetheart. It's pretty good. You came. Hey, Commander, you bumped some? Hey, you always like my barbecue. You want some food? No, thanks. Mommy and I had lunch right before she dropped me off. Ah, uh, hey, by the way, how is your mother? She's fine, but she really misses Daddy. Yeah. Listen, Danny, all that mean stuff I said about Ann and that neighbor friend of hers, what, none of that true? Oh, come on, man. You know I can take a joke. You don't think I can take a joke? You were joking, I get it. Yeah, but I crossed the line, man. I went too far. You think you can ever forgive me? It's water under the bridge. Water under the bridge. You know that. You know what? Yeah. Huh. You always liked my barbecue, didn't you? Yes, sir. You know, your daddy was the best barbecue cook in the whole regiment. You said pretty good now. Damn straight. You see that blood red metal right there on his chest? That's the best barbecue cook in the whole regiment. Uh-huh. And you see that light blue one there? Well, that's for being a good friend. You see, your daddy saved my life one time when we was in that tank together. Really? You saved Gunner's life? Sweetie, not like firefighters. Not that heroic, it's just line of duty stuff. <laughs> now, now, Commander, don't go getting all humble on us. This old jihadi had come out and had me pinned down. And if it wouldn't have been for your daddy, well, I don't know what would have happened. done the same for me and you know that. Daddy, do you think you could talk to mommy? Sweet. Look, your mother did a few things I can't really forget. I'm sorry. But she's really sorry she made you mad. And she just wants us to be a family again. Like before. <sighs> okay, sweetie. I guess we're going to talk. Oh, Daddy. I love you. Mom mommy wants us to be back together with you as a family. And she's missed you the whole time. She never even had one boyfriend. And she just talks about how much she misses you and cries all day.
See, Mommy? It was all just a big misunderstanding. Yeah, about all that. I'm terribly sorry, but I made up a whole bunch of lies about you cheating on Danny and told them to him just to see how mad he'd get. I don't know what come over me. I've just always been real jealous of you two. What y'all got, you know, a family, love, and all that stuff. And I kind of tore y'all apart. I didn't mean for y'all to get in the mix. I know I don't deserve it, but you think you could ever forgive me? Nobody's perfect, Gunner. It's okay with Danny. It's okay with me. She just wanted to say it's water under the bridge, you got it. Oh, hell. Yeah. Forgive me. Well, hey. Y'all got a lot of catching up to do, if you know what I mean. So why don't y'all go over there and handle your business, and I'll keep little Missy here occupied. It's okay, Daddy. I won't look. Come on, Daddy. Come on, we'll be fine. You sure? What's the matter? What's wrong? It's just me and you now. That's right. Just me and you. There's no one else. <laughs> wolves. <laughs> Asshole. Fucking wolves in Florida. be afraid of. Nothing at all. I mean, you could... I know. You can get out of here anytime you want. No. You gotta stay. 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 I said stay.
and stop it. Stop it. Stop cutting into Dom. I want to give him a good feeling. Danny, you've always been so wasteful. I see nothing's changed there. But maybe <laughs> you need to get your protein. I hope you get back to your regular self. Maybe. No, no. Come on. No, no. Come on, Danny. Oh. Come on, even for Mama. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. You better eat your meat. I tell you what, if you don't get your strength back, I'm gonna take care of that old lady of yours. Well, it looks like someone's still in the mood to get it around here. No. I might take you up on that offer if someone doesn't eat his meat. Stop it. Stop it. Come on. <laughs> that fuck gutter. Stop it. I haven't even started yet, Commander. Stop. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you can't do nothing. I bet you could get hard for me, couldn't you, Gunner? No, oh, yeah, couldn't you? Oh. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> I'll tell you what, Commander. Oh. This girl right here got it going on. I'm getting wet over here, Danny. She is, I see it. Are you sure you can't get it up? <laughs> oh. oh, man. Yeah. Gunner! Oh, look at my hair, yeah. Look at that. Fucking head! Oh, look at him. He's so cute. Baby, look at little puppy. Come here. Come here, little puppy. Come here, little puppy. Get out of the face, bitch. Go on with yourself. Ha ha! No. about her though. I'm gonna take real good care of her. Shut up! Just Come look on, at Daddy, her. you can do it. Oh. Climb, Daddy, can't climb. wait to get my hands up there. Uh, shut up! You're gonna fall. Just let her uh, man. Shut Just up! Just give on, baby. You're almost home. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Climb! Uh, climb! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! Go back! Go back! <laughs> Daddy, you made it. Would you like some tea? 